So this is a test drive video for this 1983 Rolls-Royce Corniche drop head coupe. And by the way, it's over 100 degrees out and uh, it's been idling and this thing runs really cold. Um, I'm uh, quite impressed and that's a good thing. We love this, the Magnolia, which is a very, very traditional um, Rolls-Royce color, uh, especially for Corniches. I, I think it's, it's one of the most popular colors. Um, and the leather is beige with a beige convertible top. This uh, one thing very special about it is it's accumulated 36,000 miles from new. So it's very low mile and has been well loved. The, uh, the wood is nearly as new, very impressive. There are some of the normal seat belt chips uh, over by where the, the uh, shoulder seat belt uh, is, but there are, there's no cracking, there are no issues with the wood. And I love, boy, with the Corniches in particular, you really can feel the suspension, uh, how, how smooth the suspension was and or is. Um, I, I can imagine in 1983 what what a wonderful difference it made. So this particular car appears to be pretty much all original. So the paint um, definitely appears to our eyes um, as being original. The leather is original. Again, we, you know, the wood appears to be original. Um, this car has definitely been garage kept and well loved. The owner believes that, um, we have a turnaround here. The owner believes that it's uh, two owners from new. It might be three, but it's, it's a, you know, very either two or three owners from new. Um, and again, 36,000 miles accumulated. Ah, I'm stuck in here. But she's really easy to drive, as you can imagine. I have to believe that these are going to uh, go up in value very, very soon. We look at the values of the uh, Silver Cloud um, drop heads. They're two to what, two hundred to four hundred thousand dollars, for the most part. So I think I think it's about time for for these to really start uh, climbing in value. Well, with that, we uh, thank you for listening and, and uh, keep on driving. Thank you. All right, now um, I'm driving by myself. <clears throat> the ride just truly, I, I would say wafting uh, is a very apt description. You really just feel like you're wafting. very very comfortable and yet the odd thing is they're super super they kind of float and yet um, if you need to you can really steer this thing and handle it um, that's kind of that's one of the nice things about Rolls Royces they're large they're heavy they're substantial but they're so well engineered
Thank you.